with Jeff Arend. I'm wondering, does this day kind of remind you of what happened in Houston earlier this season when uh, you just kept knocking them off? Yeah, a little bit. I mean, the car's running good here. You know, THL guys are doing a great job. John O'Nicky, I mean, real team, team effort, obviously, from the top to the bottom. And uh, tricky track reminds me of Houston. And uh, keep going 430s. We've been looking pretty good, I think. You'd kind of like to have that outcome duplicated. Ah, uh, yeah. See, I had a Corey and Colin Coletta are here working their, you know, what's off on the car. So it's really good to have them here. And uh, we like to win one for them. All right. Thank you. Well, we had talked earlier that you uh, want to stay away from that 10th place. You want to get above it so that you get into the countdown. That's uh, around one of those concerns. Another one is this guy right here, Bob Tasca. Currently sits ninth in the points. He surely would like to get well above that as he faces Mike Neff, number one in the points, Dave. Yeah, and over in Mike Neff's crew, I saw them add a little bit of alcohol into that 13-gallon fuel cell on front. Now, the NHRA mandates 90% maximum. They poured a little bit in, presumably, to take some of that out of there, slow the car down, and get from to me. Good race. Oh, the 2 4 tamper wow, down there. That. Mike now 422 with a 3 to a losing 423 with a 4. Nice going, Zippy. I'll tell you, but what a tough break for Bob Task. I mean, he made a fantastic run and comes up short. These were, you know, they went 425 in the first round. Mike Neff did. That was low ET of the round. And then Bob went 427. Had a great car that could have won, but unfortunately came up against this race car of Mike Neff and came up just a little bit short. I think I have been driving Tasca's car all year long where you go out and you make a great run, but the guy next to you goes and pulls low ET of the event. It happens time and time again. But but this is drag racing, man. You can do whatever you want the last run. You got to win a race by winning it right now. It's unpredictable, and it that's is what makes it cool. You bet. Take a look at our Lucas Oil photo finish cam by Justin Nose. Mike Neff advances to the semifinals.